वेलकम बैक गाइस सो टुडे आई विल एजुकेट यू अबाउट फर्स्ट कंटेंटफुल पेन एफसीपी इन दिस कोर वेब वाइटल सीरीज चेक द डिस्क्रिप्शन द लिंक टू वॉच अदर वीडियोस ऑन कोर वेब वाइटल सीरीज एंड ऑल दिस वीडियोस आर फ्यू मिनट्स सो इट इज गुड चांस फॉर यू टू लर्न अबाउट कोर वेब वाइटल इट विल ब्रिंग ए ह्यूज इफेक्ट ऑन योर वेबसाइट एंड ग्रो योर बिजनेस इन दिस वीडियो आई विल टेल यू व्हाट इज एफसीपी हाउ टू आइडेंटिफाई एफसीपी एंड हाउ टू सॉल्व इट If you want to learn such amazing content which is not easily available on YouTube, make sure to smash the like button and subscribe to my channel. And also, this is an amazing way to show your support because these videos are free for you, but they take a lot of time to create. So why not just press the like button and subscribe to the channel? With that said, let's see what is FCP or first contentful paint. So the first contentful paint FCP metric measures the time from when the page start loading to when any part of the page content is rendered on the screen. For this metric, content refers to text, images, background images, SVG elements. or any non white elements on the page so this is a nice example you can see the progression of a website how it loads on your devices so first when you open the website this is a blank page with loads and then the first thing we start loading is called fcp you can see there some text and icons here so this is the fcp of your website when something first load on your website let's take example of my website you can see the progression of my website loading you can see there are seven frames which are blank and then after the first content load So my website is failing in FCP, which is really bad thing. So you can see the first content loading on my website is very much delayed, and it is really important to understand difference between FCP and LCP. I created a video about LCP. If you want, you can check the i card or link in the description. So FCP is the first content which loads on your website, and LCP is the largest content load on your website on the first viewport. This might look little bit critical, but it is really not. Just watch this video carefully. and you will understand what is fcp and you can watch other videos also and you can understand everything about core web vitals like really easy okay so what is a good fcp score to provide a good user experience google standard says the fcp or first contentful paint should be in less than 1.8 second and as you can see on my website it is loading really bad normally website scores 100 out of 100 but just to make this tutorial i removed all the optimization from my website if the first content on your website is loading more than 1.8 second your website will fail for the fcp metrics by google page speeds in core web vitals and this is also interesting to understand that why we have this blank page on the website it happens when there lot of data is loading on your website for example lot of js and css files and fonts are loading so the text and images they load after first the browser they load all this data and then after the real design text or images they loads on the website so it is very simple logic if your website is really heavy the fcp will be really delayed so now we have big idea about fcp let's see how we can identify and fix this thing so test your website by google page speed metrics and then here in timeline section you can see the section fcp just click on fcp and you can see i have two problem for fcp on my website first is element render blocking resources and second reduce unused css files if i click here you can see i have so many css files and javascript file which are loading on my website so what happens first all these files are loading in these frames and then the first image or text loads and the second thing remove a new css so i'm using lot of css on my website which is not even used i created a really nice video about how to remove a new css from your website if you want to check the video check the i card or link in the description okay now the main thing how to improve fcp so there is a big list from the google element render blocking sources minify css remove a new css pick an act reduce server response time so many things Don't be afraid you can use just one single plugin and address all these issues and solve these things and you can have so amazing fcp on your website just to give example this is my website scoring 45 for mobile and 93 for desktop devices but if i go to mobile you can see i have issue with fcp lcp tti with everything i have issues and let me show you how i use lightspeed plugin i address all these issues now you can see here i'm not facing any lcp fcp issues and my website is going really well for all these things i did everything by using lightspeed plugin So if you want you can really address this issue one by one they're not so big thing for example minify css is not a big thing it is a very basic thing minify stm is basic thing if you want to watch this video that how i got 100 out of 100 page speed score which will automatically fix fcp for you guys so check out this video on your screen and guys if you're watching this video until now and it provides some value and you learn something new today don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel and share this video somebody who is learning web development or is your fellow student or your fellow colleague thank you so much see you in another video